Generative AI is one of the hottest technologies today and it's on the tip of everybody's tongue and ChatGPT is probably the most recognizable version of the tech. We're here with Volkswagen's upcoming ID7, one of the first electric vehicles to feature ChatGPT in the dashboard to get a look at how that technology is going to affect the way you use it on the road. Now specifically what we're talking about today is a new partnership between Volkswagen and Serence to add ChatGPT to the dashboard of Volkswagen's new gasoline and electric vehicles. Now today Ida can do pretty simple things like adjusting the climate controls, uh, initiating messages or phone calls, or even doing pretty simple destination searches. But in the future, you'll be able to talk to her like a human being and get natural messages back from the cloud. So here's how it works. You'll ask Ida a question and if it can't be handled locally, Volkswagen will pass it up through the cloud to the Serent servers. And there it will get processed by ChatGPT and then the car will speak back to you in a pretty natural way. So right now today you can say, hey Ida, set the temperature to 69 degrees. All right, I'm setting the temperature in the left front area to 69.0 degrees. But in the future, you'll be able to say, hey, Ida, I'm a little chilly. OK, warming the left front side now. And it'll be smart enough to realize that chilly means that I am cold and that the response to that is to bring the temperature up and that I'm sitting in the driver's seat. So maybe warm up this side of the car. That's the level of nuance that they're bringing. So today you can say, hey, Ida, find a restaurant nearby. There are multiple search results. Could you please select an entry from the list? And it'll give you a list of generic restaurants nearby. However, in the future, you'll be able to say, hello, Ida. I'm hungry for chicken parmesan. There are multiple search results. Could you please select an entry from the list? And the list of restaurants will be populated by Italian restaurants nearby because it knows what chicken parmesan is and it can respond to that question specifically. And because it's based on ChatGPT, you can do more than just ask it to do things relative to the car. You can ask it more complicated conversational questions like, hello Ida, ask ChatGPT to tell me about CNET in one sentence. According to ChatGPT, CNET is a popular technology media website that provides news, reviews, and information on gadgets, consumer electronics, and technology trends. Now, one of the best parts about Volkswagen and Serence's partnership is because all of it happens in the cloud, you don't have to do anything to get it. You don't have to download anything or sign up for a ChatGPT account. You'll just get in your Volkswagen and one day it'll be smarter. The technology should start rolling out in Q2 2024 in Europe and hopefully arrive later this year in North America in the ID4 and the ID7.